Hello friends, welcome back to Veltec QC, the YouTube channel of Lloyd's Institute of Technologies. My name is Vincent. In our last video, we have discussed about weld symbols and welding symbols in part one. We have just gone through the initial uh, informations uh, about, we have discussed about the differences between weld symbols and welding symbols. Now we'll continue with that, with weld symbols and welding symbols in part two. As discussed last time, a weld symbol indicates the required type of weld only, which means a weld symbol, only a weld symbol is mentioned as weld symbol. It's not welding symbol. Welding symbol contains a lot of other things. So these are most commonly used weld symbols which we have gone through last time. These are the other basic weld symbols. Okay, all these symbols, fillet symbol, V groove symbol, these are groove weld symbols and these are other weld symbols including fillet weld, plug or slot, spot weld, seam weld, back or backing weld, surfacing weld etc. And these are the supplementary symbols. Not weld symbols, but as well, it is included in the welding symbols. These are a, sometimes these are a part of welding symbol, not weld symbol. Okay, wherever and wherever and whenever it is required, only this will be used. So now let's see the welding symbol. A welding symbol includes the weld symbol and other supplementary information like what we have seen here. Supplementary symbols, the weld all around symbol. You will see the application of this field weld, that means site weld, wherever the erection takes place or wherever the field welding is to be done. These symbols will be shown and melt through consumable inserts, backing or spacer. And these are the contour. Contours means uh, after welding, how that welding should be finished. Flush, it should be flush grinding or flush grounded or uh, convex or concave. That is the finish, what kind of finish you require. Okay, now let us discuss the elements of a complete weld symbol. As I discussed in last video and a while ago, weld symbol means only a weld symbol, a, a single symbol will be, will be there. And that is called uh, weld symbol. But a weld symbol without showing in a welding symbol, I think it is useless. So a welding symbol contains reference line. Here as uh, we are given in serial number one, serial number one reference line. This is the reference line. This is the reference line. Okay. And second one is arrow. Here is the arrow. Now please note, for a welding symbol, you require at least these two components, these two elements that is reference line and arrow without this you can't call it as a complete welding symbol i mean a welding symbol these are the minimum requirement a reference line and an arrow this reference line and arrow is the minimum requirement for a welding symbol and on that you can mention whatever it is required where you can show the weld symbol or the dimensions or the finish or whether any supplementary informations if you want like weld, weld all around symbol. We will come to that. We will come to that. Okay. Now this sec the reference line and the arrow 
you have understood now now the basic wealth symbols what we have discussed just now those basic wealth symbols can be shown here either above the reference line or below the reference line okay we will we'll see that like here here they have shown below the reference line and we will will we'll see what is what it means if it is below the reference line what is the meaning of it and if it is if it is above the line like uh, in other case if it is there let us see here yeah here you can see above the reference line you can see this above the reference line a fillet well symbol is given so what is the meaning of that okay now we will go back to our welding symbol components okay this is the well basic well symbol to be placed either above the reference line or below the reference line and in case of both the side is welded to be welded then you can show it above and below above and below the reference line and the next one is dimensions and other data you can give the dimensions after showing the well symbols here you can show the the dimensions and other data here here on left hand side always this will be weld size weld size and groove size and on right hand side of the weld symbol it will be length and pitch if nothing is shown that means that the entire area to be welded if it is mentioned then that length and pitch you have to note and welding to be done according okay friends i think it's almost 8 minutes now and i think it is high time to stop it uh, we will come back with the remaining parts in the next video until then goodbye thanks for watching see you so we will be back with another video very soon see you next time until then goodbye thank you